in a series in which the winner advances to the Pac-12 tournament for the eighth and final seed. Cal takes game one of the three-game set on Thursday night, 13 to one over Utah. It was a game that started back and forth with no indication of the offensive explosion that was to come. Nathan Martorella started the scoring in the third inning with two outs facing Matthew Sox, the Utah starter who was pitching well and Martorella smashed a home run. It was his 11th of the year and extended his hitting streak to 16 games, his seventh home run over that 16 game hit streak and it gave Cal a one nothing lead. So maybe Cal has Utah back on its heels a little bit, but no, Chase Anderson would answer back the first batter of Utah's fourth inning and he would take Joseph King out. <laughs> Same reaction that he had, Martorella had. That ball a no doubter. And so Utah tied the game one apiece. Joseph King couldn't believe it. But as it turned out, that would be his only major mistake. Because in the fifth inning, everybody batted. 11 batters came to the plate, including the man that led off the inning with a walk. Dom Soto came back up for the second time in the inning. And the ninth place hitter, cleared the bases a grand slam for him an eight run inning for his team that extended the lead from five to one to nine to one Cal would score four more runs and 13 to one the final King gets the win six and two thirds from him just one earned and six K's and the Utes struggled with runners in scoring position they didn't lack opportunity two for 19 with runners on base so Game two of the series, if Cal wins it on Friday night, they clinch the eighth and final spot in the Pac-12 tournament. If Utah wins it, then we got a game for all the marbles on Saturday.